Hey friends, Joe the Farmer here. In today's video, we're gonna talk about the Massimo T-Boss 550. Now this particular machine, this is a tractor supply package that they offer. This has all the accessories you would ever need. It has some amazing options that I've never seen before in a side-by-side. -side. It comes in this beautiful veil camo, but also some other colors. And we're gonna talk about all this stuff in this video. So if you've clicked on this link, you obviously have an interest in potentially buying a side-by-side -side or some kind of machine. So I'm gonna share with you what we like, what we don't like maybe, and what the ride quality is like. We have a lot of machines here on our farm. We're actually on our family farm right now. We've tested side-by-sides and run side-by-sides, and we have a pretty good knowledge of you know what you want to look for, probably what you want to avoid. But so far from looking at this thing, this is an excellent package. It's more of a mid-size machine. This is not a huge machine. It's not a small machine, but it it's kind of hits that Goldilocks spot, right? To where it's big enough to get all the stuff done you want to do, but it'll still fit in your garage. It's not too much of a big footprint to get down a trail. So, so far, super impressed. I'm not gonna ramble on. I'm gonna show you all the different features, and then we'll take it for a ride, and then we'll wrap up. So let's get to work. Okay, as you walk up, the first thing that I notice is that it does have these nice ABS doors. These are plastic, they're gonna wear well. It has a little latch on the inside, nothing to get caught outside, it's very easy to open. No problem at all. You also have this Nerf bar, which, you know, these rock crawlers or whatever you want to call them, this is going to protect the side of it if you're really going to do some crazy stuff with your side-by-side. -side. Primarily, that's going to be uh, just nice to keep it protected. This is the cabin of the machine. As we go through, you know, steering wheel, obviously, gear shift or reverse, high, low. This is kind of the part that I really wanted to show you. So we're going to have a little bit of noise here for a sec. And that is a front camera rear camera, which is absolutely bonkers to think that a side-by-side -side has a backup camera and a front-facing camera. Uh, this is your locking differential, winch, lights, high, low beam, off, and then as you go into this touch screen, this gives you all the information you could ever need on it. It's showing your two-wheel drive, locking, diff battery voltage, you know, how much fuel do we have, which it, it's going to need some fuel here soon, um, RPMs, neutral high, reverse, and I will absolutely get rid of that <laughs> reverse beep. And also you have more feedback here with this tachometer. It gives you all the information that you need over here as well. And then you see four miles in this thing, it is brand new. And all the information as far as four wheel drive, two wheel drive, how much fuel you have, how hot or cold the machine is. And you see this name Lanai. Lanai's been building these kinds of machines for a very, very long time. So it has a Lanai motor in it. So you can feel pretty confident you're buying a good machine. Over here, you have an automotive style uh, emergency brake or handbrake, however you want to call it. And this tilt table result thing is kind of fascinating. I've, I've never seen a machine come brand new with a tilt table result. It's saying 34.3 degrees, which is insane. Don't ever do that. It's pretty exciting to think about how stable this machine is. Again, windshield, we got some uh, cleaning up to do on some of the plastic. Turn signals, left, right, and the center is just neutral. And this is how you go into four wheel drive very classic four-wheel drive shifter. I've seen this many, many times. A lot of four-wheelers, ATVs will have this kind of shifter. So locking, unlocking, two-wheel drive, four-wheel drive. It's just that simple. Now, something else that's a great feature is this right here, which is a little piston. And it's, you know, it's not like you're gonna have in your car. It's not super high end, but it's gonna give you the opportunity to adjust where you want the steering wheel. Some machines, the steering wheel is just static. You can't move it and you just have to live with it and get used to it. But this one does give you the option to move it around. This is great where you can do multiple settings. Again, a lot of the stuff is tight. It just needs to break in, which is a sign of a really well put together machine. Again, it's assembled in Texas. So this isn't assembled on a crate and shipped over here uh, or in the back of a store. So right there, I like it on this setting. Uh, just what I felt, it's a beautiful fall day here in the farm. And this is just letting a nice breeze in. You have the ability to mount a rear view mirror right here, make it more street legal. You do have side mirrors which is great. All of the interior accompaniments are really comfortable. So I'm about six foot four, I'm a big dude, and I have plenty of headroom in here. And it's, again, it's a mid-sized machine. This is not a huge machine, but as far as the cab, the cab feels very spacious. And if you look at these doors, they kind of bow out to give you a little bit more space, which is nice. I feel like two big dudes can sit in here very comfortably and not feel like you're infringing on each other's privacy. So. Okay, now that we looked at the inside of the machine, let's take a look at the outside. So right here, quickly, uh, I've left this on here because it's just helpful. T-Boss 550, this goes through all the different features. 
It gives you a lot of detail. A lot of this is gonna be on their website, massimomotor.com or tractorsupply.com. This model is a tractor supply model. So all of the features that are on here are gonna be specific for tractor supply. 493 cc's, uh, 3,000 pound winch comes standard. This will go 45 miles an hour. It's four stroke cylinder engine. Here's all the length, width, height. You can find all this information on TSC's website. You can also find it on Massimo's website. Um, transmission information, it's four wheel drive, locking differential, 33 horsepower. It does carry quite a bit of fuel for a machine this size, which is great. And it is electronic fuel injection, no more carburetors. So give you an idea of different colors it goes through. 12 month warranty. This is assembled in Dallas, Texas. So I think you can feel pretty confident knowing that you have local people that if you need to talk to someone about it, you can get there. 12 month limited manufacturer warranty covered for a year. That's pretty standard with side by sides. Again, that camo, that veil camo is just so nice. My hunting camo is actually veil. So there's a lot of camos that you can get on a machine that's just their camo, you know, but this one is licensed with veil on all kinds of real deal outdoor wear, outdoor patterns and hunting blinds and everything else. So this is, it's real deal, legit camo. Uh, here's your front camera, nice beefy bumper that's gonna help you keep, you know, knock some brush down and keep the radiator and everything protected. You have some A-arm guards, 3,000 pound winch, which is great. It's great to have a winch, especially if you're gonna take it off-road. A-arm is gonna be on the front and the back. It protects those rubber boots right there, those uh, CV boots. Once those things get split up, you need to repack them and redo it, and it's kind of a job you just don't really wanna do. Looking at the wheels, uh, black wheels, which is insanely cool with that darker camo, you know, the black door, all this black plastic stuff, which is gonna last forever and be very durable. But you know, the black wheels are, they're not the biggest wheels in the world, but who cares? You know, we're driving this thing to get it off road and to take you where you wanna go hunting or fishing or just having fun with you know, your friends riding around. Oil filters right there, serviceability is gonna be super simple. This does have a shock assist for the bed. That's gonna bring you back to the business end of the machine. That's the Lanai motor. If you don't have a tractor supply close to you and you're watching this video because you just want to get some ideas and you want to see if this machine really is as legit as people say it is, hopefully this video is helpful because this should show you the fit and finish is very, very good. Everything is tied up nicely where it's supposed to be. Everything is you know, out of the way, out of you know, harm's location. Everything is waterproofed or at least you know, has some kind of cover on there. There are grease irks on here to service it to make sure everything you know, lasts for a very long time, doesn't wear out. It's just a nice machine. Talking about the bed, tailgate, very helpful, nice to have. The bed will hold, I believe, four or 500 pounds. You're gonna wanna double check me on that, but you do have tie downs, so you can you know, strap coolers and things down. And these holes, you can put different accessory things in there to hold stuff. Again, I don't know if that's exclusive to Massimo. Having this bed configuration is nice because it does give you options there. And of course you have these slats which you can cut boards, which go between there, give you partitions here. So not the biggest bed that you're gonna find, but this is a hybrid. You know, you have some of these side-by-sides that have these massive pickup truck looking beds, and then some of them look like you could put a cooler and that's it. This, you could put, you know, six, seven bags of corn, or, you know, you could put a, a deer back there or a couple coolers, whatever you want to do. So there's a lot of storage. It's not the biggest bed. If you're looking for something massive, this may let you down. But anyway, you do have the ability to tow a lot of stuff with you. Most of us are going to be putting firewood, coolers. It's a utility vehicle. So whatever's going to help you do your job easier. So I say now what we do is we take it for a ride and give you some ride impressions and then we'll wrap up. Okay, one of the things that is the biggest test is that this full size tumbler fits in the cup holder. That's insanely important because no, no cup holders seem to ever fit them anymore. But all right, let's start her up. And off we go. Breaking it in right, we're gonna put it in low, take it up this big old hill, see how we do. Well, 
that is the Massimo T-Boss 550. It is a fun machine to drive. I think you saw on the hills and you know all the washouts and the hay and all the different things we're driving through on the trails. You're not gonna have any issues riding trails with this thing. It is a very capable machine. It's an off-road machine. We never even thought of touching four-wheel drive. It's dry out here, but if it gets wet, you know, you have four-wheel drive, you have locking differentials, you have the bed to bring stuff with you, you have the winch to get you out of trouble. So many features, so many accessories for 10,000 bucks. I really can't figure out a way that you'd go wrong if this is what you're looking for. If you're looking for something that's gonna haul lots of weight, like pallets of stuff and feed and lots of lime and fertilizer, this may not be for you. It will tow 1,200 pounds. So if you wanna put something on a trailer, you can, but if you're looking for bed capacity with tons of weight, maybe that's not the machine for you, but if you're looking to, you know, check fence lines and ride around your property, visit neighbors, take the grandkids for a ride, uh, go check the mail on a long driveway, I think you'd be really, really happy with it. So hard to say anything bad about it. I mean, we've only taken really one ride. It'll be out here, so we'll get to experience it more. If you have any questions on the machine, feel free to reach out to us on our YouTube page, Joe the Farmer, youtube.com slash Joe the Farmer, or reach out to Mossimo directly uh, on their website or to Tractor Supply in the comment section. There's a lot of people there that answer a lot of questions. They do a really good job of that, but I'm happy to answer anything I can to help. Super impressed with it. Nice machine, very comfortable. You don't feel like you're fighting the machine the whole time. There's a lot of machines out there that you do feel like you're working to keep that thing on the path. This one just kind of drove itself, but there's there's not a huge story to tell of <laughs> anything weird. It's just, it's, a, it's it's almost like an extension of you going down the trail. It's a lot of fun. So uh, thank you to Mossimo for trusting us to do this video. And again, if you have any questions, you know where to find us. I'll catch you soon. Joe the Farmer, we out.